go pop the trunk. Ugh. Push the button. Pop that Pop that for a real one. Hey, and my man's got my door dash for me. Yes, Let's sir. go. Five stars. Oh, shit. You might want to scooch that seat up a little bit. It's a little tight squeeze. <laughs> What's good, bro? How you doing, man? Good. good. Bro, I was thinking about pranking you and like telling you that I was here, but pretending that I didn't actually even fly to Philly. Oh, so you, you would be basically telling the story of when the guy stole my car. Uh, yes, basically, <laughs> basically. He's like, yo, I'm here, and then he just never ends up showing up at the bank. And he's like, I'm getting a flight. He's like, oh, never mind, I never got the flight. Yeah, sounds about right. <laughs> yeah, dude, I just landed. Come pick me up. And then when you got here, just be like, yeah, no, I'm actually not even here. I'm yeah. not even at the airport. Oh, dude, that cane smells so good. I got a sandwich, right? Yeah. And the sandwich which comes with two pieces of Texas toast on it, which is insane. Dude, I ate another four pieces. Another four pieces of Texas toast? Yeah, I ordered four more. <laughs> I actually ordered extra, so I have an extra one for you too. Oh my God, this guy. So how many calories did you eat today? <laughs> Did I, you even track? No, Julie and I really honestly haven't been tracking the past like a uh, couple of days because of um, you know my birthday and everything. Oh, happy birthday by the way. Thank you. I got you a gift, but it's not gonna be here for a couple days. Oh, thank you, brother. I appreciate it. Yeah. Wrong way. We did, we did Bro, we did the more. same shit last time you picked me up. Yeah. Oh, shit, you're going around again? Yeah, we did this last time too. Yeah. Lance f***ed up like six times when he picked me up the last I time. Oh, I did. Bro, it took us like in an hour and a half to get home. For real. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, I think we're gonna loop around with me, all right? Round two. Gonna give me a little pull in the uh, 6,000 pound X6M, and then we're doing the Lambo tomorrow. I can't wait to see that fucking thing. All the anticipation. That was a little weak. Yeah, that was weak. It sounds good. It sounds really good. That was a weak pull. Sometimes it pulls real hard. Next time you come to Florida, I gotta give you an actual pull in the Hellcat. Yes, for sure, because I didn't get one last time. That'll be in like five months. Five months? Nah. Nah, you gotta come sooner than that. Dude, you I, come pretty quick, I you know? come pretty quick. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It probably doesn't pull like the Lambo does, though. Oh, hell no. You'll, you'll get a ride in that tomorrow. Yeah, you gonna make my titties bounce all over the place? Yes, sir. Can't wait. I'm gonna put you in a bra, bro. I'm use my clickbait. Bro, am I even gonna fit in that fucking car? Um, yeah, you will. Actually, yeah, bring you for a ride in Julia's car too. Yeah, and then go for a ride in the plaid again. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Hazel! Hi, honey. Hi. 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 Oh, I missed you so much. I missed you. Oh, you little whimpers. You little whimpers. You're so cute. You really haven't grown much since the last time I saw you. Nah, she probably put on like a pound. She's like still so tiny. Hi. Hi, cutie. Hi. Hi. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. She's so cute. Alrighty, so it is currently the next day in Jersey. Last night when we got back to Lance's, played a little bit of Call of Duty, ended up passing out. Well, I didn't fall asleep until like 4.30 in the morning, but damn, I must have brought the Florida weather with me. Yeah, bro, you got here Holy shit. It's been nice as this whole week. Is it about to rain all week or what? Oh, no, we'll see. Damn, look at the Lambo. Yes, First sir. check. Sheesh. Oh, look at the fucking wheel. I know, bro. I gotta get it Oh, fixed. no. If you guys saw my previous video, uh, I think I ran the card a little too hard when I was racing it. We raced against a Lamborghini STO, Ferrari 488 Pista, and a Tesla Model S Plaid. Dude, you know what it was probably from? It was probably from all the rocks. Yeah. Because you had mad rocks had on rocks your car. Over that track, bro. Yeah. Yeah, the rocks were literally like coming up on here. I just cleaned all of my cars yesterday, and then like 40 minutes after I cleaned them all, bro, <clears> it, it rained. Yeah, that's how it goes. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably what it's from. The rocks were probably hitting it because it almost feels like it just almost feels like a hard piece of plastic yeah it's like a rubber the it's car plastic was so hot that it was bending yeah your brakes probably heated it up you could see it's like rock hard bro you can't you can't bend that, that right ain't now. the only thing that's rock hard my boy it's definitely not me so much Sheesh. You, dude this thing is sick it's so tiny it's so small it's like half your height like you could sit in the car and just give me a blow job right out of the uh, window right. <laughs> got the venino wing on here dude it looks fucking sick it's like a fucking rc car man's got a rock stuck in his fucking tire really yeah yeah i left like a little hole it didn't go through though so you're chilling let's see what kind of fucking grippies do you got on here Look, oh p zeros i already got bird shit on it Two spots, one right there, one right here. Yeah, P zeros. Yeah, poo poo. Yeah. Need better tires for I'll sure. Get better tires. Yeah. They're thick, bro. They're like 335s. 355. They're 355s. Do some like Nitto NT555 R2s. Is, it, is this gonna be the test to see if I can fit? Yeah. All right, let's see. Yeah. 
<clears throat> oh, <laughs> smokes. <laughs> oh. I mean, you could definitely move the steering wheel up, but. <laughs> bro, what the f this thing got a sunroof so I can stick my head out of it? Bro, I could you, you could lower the seat? I can't even sit up straight. <laughs> hey, that's better. That, that's max low, but my head is still hitting the fucking bro. ceiling, dude. Holy smokes. Yeah, I don't really fit. I don't think I could ever get a Lambo. I mean, if you guys see, my head's literally hitting the fucking ceiling. I mean, you can definitely take a joyride in it. I could definitely take a joyride in it, but as far as, like, comfortably driving this car, yeah, definitely it not. just ain't for me. Too fucking fat. Looks good in here. This is the fucking roll cage. I feel like maybe if you didn't have the roll cage, I'd be able to fit a little bit yeah, better. Definitely. If the seat could go back further. All right, here, I need you to hold this again, because now I got to get out. Oh, holy f <laughs> Jesus it's Christ. It's definitely not a fun car to get out of, for sure. Bro, getting out was easier than getting in. But yeah, it's a tight squeeze. Take Julia's car to the diner. Yeah, we about <laughs> to go get some food. What do you like better, this or the XXM? XXM. Yeah? It's way faster. This car is perfect for Julia, honestly, because it's very petite feeling. Like, I don't have the key on me right now, but you'll see her steering wheel is very, like, thin. Oh, dude, it's so tiny. Yeah. Because we both have the big, chunky carbon fiber steering exactly. wheels. Exactly. But even, like, a normal, like, OEM steering wheel usually isn't that thin. Yeah. I think it's because she got the Alcantara wheel. What kind of bug is that, bro? That's a love that bug. A lightning, lightning bug. No, that's a love bug. Yeah, we got those f***ers in Florida. 100% that was a lightning bug, bro. Bro, I'm telling you, they, they light up. You've never seen? I know what a lightning yeah. bug is. Yeah. I know what it is. But love bugs look the exact same. They had their black with the orange heads. You just want <laughs> That's why. Yeah, like, whatever, bug, dude. Bug, bug, whatever. <laughs> so we'll be able to ride in the Porsche over to the diner. Got to ride in the X6M last night. You guys didn't really get a good walk around of this car because it was dark. So give you a little walk around real quick. Got the white spec, carbon fiber hood. They ate like grapes. yogurt or something. <laughs> yeah, they ate <laughs> grapes. Dude, the carbon fiber hood looks so fucking aggressive. Yeah, it's amazing. See, now if this was my car, bro, I would do all the grill pieces carbon fiber. I would just carbon fiber this thing the f out yeah but it's very expensive bro this this photo this was like six grand dude when i got my hellcat i had a twenty two hundred dollar real carbon fiber splitter on the front and i was on the highway and one of the splitter rods broke I saw that the whole thing up the red interior oh my god it just makes the car you guys can't really see the red interior right now because of the glare on the windshield but dude look at this shit. red interior is just so clean especially on white white on red interior lance ended up powder coating the wheels gloss black which they look good Definitely really dirty. There are bird everywhere. They just come out here for target practice. 100%. And then of course, we have the plaid. Oh yeah, I was gonna say, why does it feel like there's missing something in the driveway? It's the M4. Yeah, it's usually over there at my dad's. I brought it over to the shop right now. Oh, it's at the shop? Yeah. That's the one car that's missing out of the collection is the M4. Coming to the infamous Philly diner to grab some food. Used to come here all the time when I lived in Jersey with Lance. I loved this place. Let's see, what are we getting today? Mm. Full stack with meat. Sounds pretty good. What does that even mean? <laughs> Bruh. Yo, we're in public. <laughs> There's my clickbait for the next vlog. You did this in public? <laughs> yeah, Lance Stewart caught in public. Hmm, let's see. I think I might do Eggs Benedict, to be honest. Instead of going with Eggs Benedict, I ended up getting a chicken salad sandwich. Fruit Looks salad. phenomenal. Yummy, yummy. yummy. <laughs> Lance is over here and got a fruit salad on top of French toast. Mm -hmm. And then Julia got a California wrap. Food looks good. This is my first time seeing one of these in person. This is the new Acura Integra. Not a huge fan of it. I really liked the old body style of the Integras a little bit more, which I think they could have brought into the newer Integra. Overall, it's a clean car, but yeah, not the biggest fan. I wish I had the go-kart to be able to whip it around the mall. Yeah, wouldn't be the first time. Bro, they're literally just over here talking about Julia's head. Lance is like confessing his love for Julia's tiny head. Anyways, I ended up grabbing some earrings. I feel like these ones are a little bit bigger than the earrings that I had before I ended up losing them, but I mean, doesn't look too bad. Now we're gonna head out to Champs, grab a couple t-shirts, stuff like that, maybe some new shorts, and then probably head back to the house, maybe do a launch in the Lambo. If not, we're gonna play some new zombies and new Call of Duty maps. Yeah, these earrings look all right. Lance has a full-blown erection right now because of Cinnabon. Man's is so horny for some Cinnabon. We'll come back, we'll come back. It's gonna be right. All right. Uh, it's like ice cream. Cookies, Cookies and cream, mm. 
And then they got Jalapenos. Ended up grabbing a couple pairs of Nike shorts at Champs, and then also just the CSG black tees. You guys know I swear by these t-shirts. Got all the goodies. Should we going to Cinnabon now? If you want it. I'm not getting Cinnabon. No, I'm not. stuffed, dude. Yeah, I had freaking a sandwich, some french fries. Bro, I can't eat as much you as you. You mini Cinnabon. As big as I am, I really don't eat that much. We've talked about this before. I can eat non-stop. I can't. I have no room for Cinnabon, no room for anything. And I didn't even finish all my fries at Philly's Diner either. Wawa runs? Nah. Sephora runs. Cinnabon and Cinnabon runs. runs. Now we're at Sephora. Julia doesn't even know what she wants. She's just doing some shopping. You're just like recording my ass. Yeah, it's so thick. Mmm. Shake it, daddy. It don't even shake, bro. Literally <laughs> no fat on anymore. It literally all went away. I got lean and like all the fat on my ass disappeared. I got some for you. Yeah? Yeah. I'll take it out of my stomach and we'll I'm just like, put I'm it right like in your ass. Bro, you're just like a pancake. I didn't say get fat for my ass for my stomach uh, and my titties. Yeah, we can do that. Yeah. Lance is out here with the fur Jesuses on. I just slide Julia. No, you have to go patty. That dude, that looks so hot. Oh, <laughs> oh So walking into the living room, kind of looks like my house. You know, you got a little toy here, toy there, toy here, whatever. But then you come over to the couch. Oh my God. You have so many toys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. A sock. B a bone. You just have toys everywhere. Come here, come here, come here. Hi. We weren't even gone that long. Oh, look at you jumping up on the couch all by yourself. Look at you jumping on the couch all by yourself. Good girl. Lance is currently getting his hair cut. Julia is at her mom's house and Lance ordered some Primo subs. Wants me to go pick it up. So we're gonna take out the X6M. I know I'm definitely gonna have to adjust his seat cause my man sits like a straight grandma cause he's five foot nothing. So let me scooch this seat all the way back. We'll take this. We're gonna go get some food, baby. Also, while I'm out and about and on the way home, I'm gonna swing by Best Buy really quick. I need to get a mouse pad. Lance has two gaming setups, so I'm playing on one of them, but his one mouse pad is literally the size of my left ass cheek. It's so small, and I'm so used to playing on a giant mouse pad that literally takes up the entire desk. So I'm gonna swing by here real quick and grab a mouse pad. So we literally just woke up not too long ago. Second day in Jersey. It's raining. I want to go for a ride in the Lambo oh, so bad, so but I brought the Florida weather with me. So you know what we did instead? Ordered f***ing pizza. We ordered pizza for breakfast. Pizza and lava cakes for breakfast. Breakfast. breakfast! Yes, sir. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about eating pizza for breakfast, but... Well, today's my last day that I'm allowing myself to cheat, because we're going to a steakhouse later tonight. It's basically all you can eat, so after that, I'm zoning in on my diet and going back, because, bro, I'm up 10 pounds. Yeah, and I know you say that, but I think you may have fallen off the wagon. I, I thought that too, but I need to like, I literally, I, I can't bro, I have to just completely zone in. Don't look at me like that, bro. He's gonna be like, <laughs> nah, bro. Tomorrow, I'm telling you right now, tomorrow, I'm not gonna be here tomorrow because I'm getting ready to head up to New York to visit my family, but I know Lance is gonna hit me up and he's gonna be like, yo, I it got Applebee's, dude. I got Friendly's ice cream. I ate like 6,000 calories I today. Before, bro, I can't allow myself to get back to that point because I was miserable. I hated the way I felt. I hated the way I looked. Mentally, physically, I just felt like shit. So I'm not doing that. After we're done eating pizza, Lance is gonna go to the gym. I said I would go to the gym, but Lance wants to go for like two fucking hours. Yeah, bro. I cannot go to the gym for two take, hours. Take my other car and drive back. I think I'll just play COD, to be honest. <laughs> we absolutely fucked up this Domino's pizza. We just both, the two of us. We both had four pieces, and then I just had a lava cake, and now I'm eating another lava cake. And then I have a lava cake over there, but I'm so stuffed right now, I can't even That's eat crazy, it. That's crazy, man. Yeah. I just ate, this is gonna be like 1,800 calories. I'm gonna go work out. Hopefully I don't puke. Yeah, I'm gonna go work out too. Yeah? Yeah, I'm gonna work out my thumbs and fingers. Yeah, yeah. he's gonna go play COD. <laughs> All right, Cody's about to get his first ride in the Lambo. You ready, son? Yes. Let's go. As it's starting to rain. Oh no. It's been raining. Look, it's all over. You know what I feel like right now? What? I feel like I'm sitting on that fucking nine bot go kart. Yeah, you can barely fit. Dude, I do not fit in this car. I'd never get a Lambo. Oh sh there goes my fucking phone. Good luck. Rest in peace. Oh, oh, the no. abyss. I got it. I got it. Oh here, let me just put it in the cup holder. Oh wait. There fucking isn't any. <laughs> There's <laughs> one and it pops out and your knees blocking it. A three hundred thousand dollar car with no fucking cup holders. <laughs> turbo noises but i love my supercharger noises in the hellcat turbo's better though and i don't know i like the supercharger one leave personally. a comment down below let me know what do you think's better turbo or supercharged sound oh my god you hear all those rocks 
video. Bro, so let me ask you a question. Okay. When you're driving and you're like on the highway, for example, okay. and you're passing someone that has their window rolled down, <laughs> do you floor it past them so they can hear your car? I, I never. That's never a thought in my head. I just do what I want. Oh. So if I want to, I will. But I don't. I don't like. But I'm mindful though. If there's like an old ass lady and I'm driving by her, bro, I'm not gonna floor it. Yeah. See me. I'm just built different, bro. You ready? Listen to this. System malfunction. Uh oh. Okay. Well, it's still popping. <laughs> Have vehicle service. <laughs> this happens sometimes. I don't know why. I would definitely get a look at though. This person's on my. Should shoot a flame at them. Burn their fucking. Yeah, their bumper. <laughs> <laughs> Burn their fucking headlights. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Love you guys. Ready? Yep. I'm spinning. Yeah, you are. I'm spinning. Spinning like a mother. Bro, we didn't go anywhere. No. We <laughs> didn't move a fucking inch, dude. No. Stability control malfunction. She literally was just spinning. Hey, what's crazy? I got no traction. No traction? But the tires were spinning so fast that you can feel the end of the car raised from the tires and expanding holy shit man tries again <laughs> you're not gonna get traction bro the ground's too wet this guy's staring he's gonna call the cops yeah he's definitely gonna call the cops yeah do you see him coming out yeah don't be doing that in front of my goddamn house god damn it bobby So we just ended up getting back to Lance's house, took out the Lambo, super, super fun car to drive. But I haven't been able to hear the exhaust from the outside. Also, the Lambo shoots flames and I haven't been able to see him yet. So we're gonna get my first reaction outside of the car to hear how it sounds and also be able to see the flames. All right, so here we go. Definitely pretty loud from the outside. It's not as loud as the Hellcat from like a cold start, well, not even a cold start, but from like an iPhone. Yo, man, this almost killed me. Bro, I only have one hand to go. Okay, yeah, we get it. Holy fuck. Dude, my brain is rattling. I think I just had a stroke. 
Wait, is it like an active exhaust? I so you turn it on. you can open and close like the valves? Yeah, there's a button on the side. Oh, sick. Yeah, it's definitely not as loud as the Lambo. Uh, that's still nice. It's not as loud as the M4 either. That sounded nice. Bro, your neighbors fucking probably hate you. 100%. I still love the carbon fiber hood on this thing. It looks so fucking mean from the front. So aggressive. Alright, uh, you wanna hear the Tesla now? Yeah. Uh, Rev the fuck out of that thing when you get in it. My neighbors are really gonna hit me. Yeah, make sure you bounce that throttle off the rev limiter. I'm actually gonna put it in neutral so if you see it hear anything. <laughs> <laughs> it just starts rolling backwards. Dude, I tried the same thing in my Tesla. It makes no noise at all. No fing noise at all. Lance is gonna plug in the Tesla for me, get it all charged up so that way I'm good for my road trip up to New York tomorrow. Definitely appreciate you letting me do this again, saving me 450 bucks. Yeah, that's wild. Yeah. Oh, you guys, yours is outside. Yeah. Yeah, I got to figure out what I'm going to do with mine. Because I got the supercharger installed and then sold the Tesla and now I have the Hellcat. So it's just chilling in there. Yeah, I wish I would have known. I would have bought yours. Yeah, because you got yours like, what was it? It was like a, like a week before. Or yeah, like a week before I sold my Tesla, I think. Yeah. Get this bad boy all charged up. Eight hours. Eight hours to charge? Yeah. Seven. It's going down. Realistically, it should probably only take like four or five hours. That's how mine is. Yeah, it's in about seven hours right now. That's bad. Not bad. <laughs> Look at this man's cookie collection Hold dude on, bro you, i just put them all away yeah he's like yo you want a cookie if like bro he lance is the worst influence i'm the ever. cookie dealer bro dude, look at this shit. man's got every flavor and combination in the entire world and look this is a this was like a 16 pack of crumble yeah so what we're gonna do lance is gonna put those ones away we're gonna try these four cookies so a crumble chocolate chip whatever brand chocolate chip this is bang cookies chocolate brownie and then cinnamon whiskey Crackle. Yeah. I don't know. That one doesn't sound too appetizing. Honestly, to me, but. bro, we had a lot more cookies too. There was this company that sent us twelve dollar cookies each, and there was like sixteen of them, bro. Each, each cookie's cookie twelve dollars. Box. We're crazy. How big are they? They're like, like about the size. Like this They're size. Like six ounce cookies, but they were crazy good. They're all, like all different types of flavors too, man. Like lava cake, just like crazy insane flavors that like mm. really has for cookies. So. Speaking of lava cake, it's gone. Yeah. I ate my lava cake earlier. That it was so good. I ate them, the two earlier and I actually have another one in there from like a month ago. Yeah, man, it's just be stocking up on sweets. 100%. We, we had a lot in the fridge. We ate a lot of these cookies. We already. ate one night, we just went ham on all of them. Yeah, we had like seven cookies in that one night, dude. That's crazy. Yeah. I could never, dude. I could never. I'm excited for this one right here. And I and I guess the crumble to see which chocolate chip cookies better. So here we are, Bogo de Chow. It's just just Lance and I. We're just out on a date together, getting some like starters. We got some like chicken salad, potato salad, and a roasted cauliflower. So I ended up eating like a bunch of different kinds of meat, paws, and then also ended up getting some of these plantains. The first round we got didn't have cinnamon on it. This round <laughs> yo, that's so hey, yo. hot. Hey, yo. The second round we got has cinnamon on them, which I think the cinnamon adds a nice little touch. Yeah, what do you sure. think? Fire. It's fire. As if the food we just ate wasn't enough. I got a shake, This fat ass is getting Shake Shack. Look at these three new shakes they have. Excuse me, where's my shake? Where? Here. Man's shaking his imagination. <laughs> Where do you go to see the shakes right here? Lance got this sprinkle cookie shake. They have like an Oreo cookie funnel cake and a chocolate churro shake. You won't get one. If I were to get one, I'd get the same one you got, the sprinkle cookie shake. But because it's the lowest in calories? No, because it, <laughs> it, it just sounds the best and looks the best. This is the last time I ever come to Jersey. Look at this. Crispy cream. cream kids. Lance literally sucked me out of the house. Pause to come with him to get milkshakes or Suck smoothies. In the house. Yes, that too. And on the way here, give me some uh, Texas Roadhead. 100%. <laughs> wow, bro. What is strawberry banana smoothie? Bro, the peanut butter cup. Wow. That's fire i literally can't eat any of this Wait, dude peeled banana and milk i've literally been peeing out of my ass for the last three hours oh, you won't get a dip milk you're right i'm not getting anything because my stomach hurts should i get two things dude out of this whole thing the only two i probably get is the pb cup or the snickers mm, strawberry banana is just so basic oh, it sounds lit it's so basic though how's this thing work <laughs> Ooh, he's stealing. I'm curious to see how this thing works. Choose your thickness. Why didn't you do thick? I don't want thick for a smoothie, but it's gonna suck. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Trying to freaking suck it in. Yeah, now blending. Oh, sh where did 
Where'd it go? Oh, yeah, it did. Damn, everything is just getting sucked up today. What does it do? Like, add milk to it or some shit? I don't want the, the banana, bro. One's enough. Self control. See, let's scoop for a second. It's meant to be. It's meant to be. All right, go ahead. Get your freaking dipped banana. Yeah, that's because you want some. Why would you get strawberry banana and dipped banana? I bet. You PB like cup. bananas or what? PB cup? Do you think it's yeah, chocolate I would ice get, cream now? I would get PB cup. You don't like chocolate ice cream? Chocolate. Dude, this vlog is just going to be 90% eating like fat f and then the other 1% is going to be like car stuff. Dude, I'll just get a donut. Or 10%. Sorry, bad at math. <laughs> Dude, are you for real? <laughs> dude, are you for real? <laughs> you for real, dude? I, it doesn't even look appetizing to me. I don't know. No. Nah. Is it good? It's <laughs> Man's decided he's getting two shakes. He said the strawberry banana one's okay. Yeah, it's all right. But I guess it's not what he expected it to be. Oh, so he's like. going to get a PB cup. You can't go wrong with cookies and cream, though. Mm, I don't know. I do PB cup, but I love peanut butter, so. Do you think it's chocolate ice cream? I mean, it's going to get all mixed up anyways, so. Right, huh? Dessert is served. After Lance had his shitty shakes, he was contemplating going to Wawa. Wow, these kids are walking to the But too. instead, he decided to come over to fucking Taco Bell, get some late night Taco Bell, sucked down his milkshake. He's been freaking trying to get the little crumbs out of it for the last 20 minutes. <laughs> Bro, I think it's gone. I think it's gone. Mm. Dude, we literally have people standing in the drive through That's like what are you guys doing, doing bro. i thought you had to be in a car in a drive through for them to serve you what is there like a hotel around here like where are these people even coming from foreman mills <laughs> that's where they live, <laughs> they live foreman in fucking... mills. oh dude i saw that sign resident residence oh that's probably where they're coming from residence in there's like a hotel behind it but i could have sworn that was an applebee's sign <laughs> bro you're annoying good morning youtube bright and early it's about 9 15 in the morning right now headed off to new york i'm in the plaid right now looks like we gotta stop and charge a couple times along the way which is no big deal but do want to give a huge shout out to lance again for letting me use the plaid man definitely hooking it up saving me like 450 bucks from getting a rental car so we got about a four hour and 20 minute drive up to New York for the weekend. About an hour and 40 minutes into the drive, making a pit stop at the Tesla station, charge up a little bit, and I got to take a leak. Alrighty, so I made it up to New York. I already swung by my grandparents' house. I had some lunch. I do apologize for the sirens. There's an ambulance behind me right now. Had to come to the vape shop to get some vape, and here, let me roll up the window. This is obnoxious. The vape shop happens to be right by where Aubrey, my daughter, lives. So she had no idea that I was even coming up here. I grabbed the vape real quick, and then I was like, you know what? Let me head over, see if she's at her grandparents' house, and see if I can surprise her. So I showed up. She was there. She gave me the biggest hug. I wanted to record her reaction, but at the same time, I haven't seen her in a while, so I kind of just wanted to be able to cherish the moment. But it was super exciting to see her. She's got a softball game tomorrow morning morning that I'm going to go to. And then we have my stepdad's surprise birthday party. So it's definitely going to be a fun little trip up here and it'll be good to see all my family, spend some time with my daughter and just enjoy this little vacation. 